Hello and welcome back to Administrator 1. The first section focuses on what an administrator needs to know when setting up an installation and some routine tasks. This section continues examining routine tasks and focuses on the tasks an administrator occasionally performs. In this section, we're going to examine low latency processing and the different runtime types. This includes atom workers, certificates, and listeners. The term latency is the delay from input or the receipt of inbound information request until the execution begins processing. To set a document as low latency, click the process mode on the start shape, or you can click the options in the process canvas. There are two process mode types, general and low latency. Low latency greatly increases process execution speed by not logging every process state. This reduced logging allows the process to execute mainly in memory where changes in other shapes can execute quickly. If you need to execute a high volume of process calls within a short time, access low latency. As I mentioned, to obtain faster performance, a low latency process does not track as much information as a traditional process. It does not track request or response data, meaning you cannot view request or response data, and you cannot retry a low latency process. Process metrics are not recorded in the view process state dialog. The process is available. The inbound data's document logs are disabled. When a process runs in low latency, it executes in the heap space allocated and does not use the shared file storage to store the data. When running the data across the network to the data storage, it causes a performance effect. Low latency reduces the amount of data written to the file share. If the services enabled feature is installed with a local atom or molecule, there are no further requirements. If you use services enablement within the Dell Boomi Atom Cloud, you must contact your Dell Boomi support team about having an Atom Worker, which will be discussed in the next slide, enabled for your account. The following connectors are listeners in low latency mode processes Atom Q, JMS, MDM Listener, MLLP Server, and the Web Services Server. When a process call volume is high and a requirement is low latency, an atom worker can be used to meet the necessary performance. An atom worker is a reserved resource in the Dell Boomi Atom Cloud or in the private atom cloud dedicated to processing certain types of requests for a given account. So if you are using a local atom or molecule, you do not have access to atom workers. The following connectors make use of atom workers. AS2 Shared Server, JMS, MDM Listener, MLLP Server, and Web Services Server. Now please note, if you use the Dell Boomi Atom Cloud and would like to enable Atom Workers in your account, or if you would like to have more Atom Workers enabled for your account, please contact your Dell Boomi representative. If you are using an Atom Worker on the Dell Boomi Atom Cloud, the following limitations apply. For Web Services Server connections, the greatest number of simultaneous Web Service Process executions is 20, with 10 queued. For Low Latency Mode, requests running on the Atom Worker, the greatest Web Server Process execution time is 30 seconds. You can set a process to use Low Latency in the Process Options dialog. There are some minor differences in the process executions using an atom worker. First request causes the atom worker to start and can cause some delay in execution time. On the attachments quota tab, cloud owners can set the minimum atom worker's property. The property specifies the number of atom workers needed to run at all times. Atom workers are configured to run for a specific time. The default is 24 hours and then to shut down automatically. A new atom worker starts at the next request. Cloud owners can also set the atom worker warm up enabled property to make sure the atom workers are running and ready to take over when the other atom worker is shut down. You can change the length of time after the atom workers stop. 
Listener processes are used for event-based integrations. The start shape of the listener process has a connector with the listener action. Once a listener process is deployed, the start shape monitors incoming requests to the endpoint defined by the shape's connector operation and the atom's server settings. Each incoming request is routed to the rest of the process along with any post-it document. The following connectors support the listen action. AS2 Shared Server, AtomQ, JMS, MLLP Server, SAP, and the Web Services Server. In the case of the Web Services Server, endpoints can optionally be defined the API management feature is enabled. Within Atom Management, the Listener's Panel is deployed for listener processes to individual atoms, molecules, and atom clouds. For each listener, it is possible to restart selected or all listeners for the selected atom, molecule, or atom cloud. From the Actions Gear menu, there are links to process components and execution reporting. Please note, Test Mode does not support real-time triggering and cannot be used with a listener process. This concludes our session. We will now be moving on to dashboards.